We continue on page 192 with the offertory. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me. Cast me not away from thy presence, and take not thy Holy Spirit from me. Restore unto me the joy of thy salvation, and uphold me with thy free spirit. Amen. We sing hymn 809, The Great is Thy Faithfulness. Great is thy faithfulness, O God, my Father. There is no shadow of turning with thee. Thou changest not thy compassions, they fail not. As thou hast been, thou forever wilt be. Great is thy faithfulness, Great is thy faithfulness, morning by morning new mercies I see. All I have needed thy hand hath provided. Great is thy faithfulness, Lord, unto me. Summer and winter and springtime and harvest, sun, moon, and stars in their courses above, join with all nature in manifold witness to thy great faithfulness, mercy, and love. Great is thy faithfulness, great is thy faithfulness. Morning by morning new mercies I see. All I have needed thy hand hath provided. Great is thy faithfulness, Lord, unto me. Pardon for sin, and a peace that endureth. Thine own dear presence to cheer and to guide. Strength for today, and bright hope for tomorrow. Blessings are mine, with ten thousand beside. Great is thy faithfulness, great is thy faithfulness. Morning by morning new mercies I see. All I have needed thy hand hath provided. Great is thy faithfulness. Lord, unto me. We will continue with the prayer of the church. Let us pray for all people of God and for all people according to their needs. Lord God, Heavenly Father, we thank you for the wedding feast, that right now those who have died, who have gone through the shadow of the valley of death, have reached that pasture where they receive their great war reward. Lord, you have swallowed up their death forever. Lord, we pray that we are held in your shepherding hands and brought to rest with you, that we don't reject the great gift, that as the feast is coming, as the wedding is accomplished, all the work that you have done through us and in us, Lord, isn't bespoiled by our own selfish desire to do things ourselves and not rely upon you. Put the wedding gown on us, Lord. Let us wear it forever. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Heavenly Father, we pray for the leaders of our nation. May they be good shepherds. 
We pray that you act as a shepherd to our soldiers and police officers, our emergency workers, and those involved with disasters, our farmers, and those involved in transporting goods to the market. Lord, watch over them and guide them so that they too might come to rest in glory with us. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Heavenly Father, end this lockdown, if it is your will. Bring an end to this disease, so that those who have been isolated and away from their brothers and sisters, away from the family of Christ, might join once again, might feast in the presence on the joys as limited as they sometimes are that you give today, might rest in the assurance and the comfort and fellowship so that they can have those joys perfected in the marriage feast to come. Lord, in particular, we pray that you be with Helen, Rick, John, Bev, Eli, Bev, Herman, Marie, and Bernice, and also, Lord, Irma, Joe, Margie, Marcel, Pete, Lois, Rodney, and Stella. Lord, give them strength, give them healing, and make sure that they always rely upon you. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Into your hands, O oh Lord, we commend all for whom we pray, trusting in your mercy through Jesus Christ, our Lord. And we join in the prayer that he taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. We turn to 201. The Lord be with you, and with thy spirit. Bless we the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. Amen. 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 We close with hymn 924. Lord, dismiss us with your blessing. Lord, dismiss us with your blessing. Fill our hearts with joy and peace. Let us each your love possessing, triumph in redeeming grace. Oh, refresh us, oh, refresh us, traveling through this wilderness. Thanks we give and adoration for your gospel's joyful sound. May the fruits of your salvation in our hearts and lives abound. Ever faithful, ever faithful, to your truth may we be found. Savior, when your love shall call us from our struggling pilgrim way, let not fear of death appall us, glad your summons to obey. May we ever, may we ever reign with you in endless day. Go in the peace of Christ. Amen.